In order to navigate and locate places around the globe, people use lines of latitude and longitude. But what's the difference? Latitude is the measurement of distance north or south of the equator. The equator is at zero degrees of latitude, whilst the latitude of the North Pole is 90 degrees north and the South Pole is 90 degrees south. There are a few really important lines of latitude and longitude that you should be aware of. The equator is probably the most famous of all the lines of latitude and longitude, and it separates the Northern Hemisphere from the Southern Hemisphere. As you move north and south of the equator, you'll reach the tropics. These are lines of latitude at 23.5 degrees north and south of the equator and are named after star signs. Cancer in the north, Capricorn in the south. These are the points where during the solstice, the sun is directly overhead, its highest point furthest from the equator, making the days longer or shorter depending on the time of year. Cancer is in June, so the sun is at its highest over the Tropic of Cancer on or around the 21st of June, the longest day in the Northern Hemisphere. Capricorn is in December, and the Sun is at its highest in the Southern Hemisphere in December, giving the longest days of the year in places like Australia, where the Northern Hemisphere countries at the same time have their shortest day. This is all to do with the tilt of the Earth at 23.5 degrees and the revolution of the Earth around the Sun. Two more important lines of latitude are found at 66.5 degrees north and south, and these are the Arctic and Antarctic circles. Again, due to the tilt of the Earth at 23.5 degrees, areas at higher latitudes than these circles at certain points during the year will either have 24 hours of sunlight or 24 hours of darkness. Longitude is the measurement east or west of the prime meridian, which is at zero degrees. It's measured by imaginary lines that run around the Earth vertically and meet at the North and South Poles, with 180 degrees being the maximum value for longitude. Unlike lines of latitude, lines of longitude are the same length, and they all meet at the North and South Poles. The two most important lines of longitude are the Prime Meridian, sometimes called the Greenwich Meridian, due to the observatory located at Greenwich, London, having a great reputation for producing excellent navigational maps. The Prime Meridian is at zero degrees of longitude and separates the world into the Eastern and Western Hemispheres. Lines of longitude are measured east and west of this point until they reach 180 degrees. This is the approximate location of the International Dateline where days start. The Earth rotates from west to east anti-clockwise when viewed from the North Pole, meaning that countries in the Eastern Hemisphere will experience the start of the day before those in the West. Due to the disjointed nature of the international dateline, there are some island nations that have a 26-hour time difference. So, there you have it. The difference between latitude and longitude. I'll see you on the next What's the Difference. Bye for now.